everybody, welcome to my Art Journal Watch Along video. I'm Sarah, the artist behind Pitzel Geschichten. And this week I'm working with paper and acrylics and a tiny bit of gesso to make my page. So first I'm uh, taking some book pages and uh, one page from a magazine where there is a crafter or woodworker which uh, who works with his or her hands a lot so the topic of the week is hands now if you've seen um last thursday's taco challenge you know that due to funny weather over here like spring storms and pretty much one day it's hot and dry and the next day it's raining like crazy here my hands are well hurting a lot and I uh, well gotta I gotta be quite careful with how long I do artwork in a day because uh, later during the day I can't hold a brush or anything because it just hurts and I don't want to take painkillers because I know that kind of drill it uh, passes in a few days whenever the weather stabilizes a bit but it made me realize this week that I really have my hands being my major tool for artwork. Well, surprise, surprise, you know? So yeah, the page is all about that. And once I have glue, glued down all the paper, I'm working with a tiny bit of gesso here and a palette knife just to get started with um, pushing the paper a bit into the background. So uh, I'm drying that off and then I'm going in with different kinds of acrylics just to have a basic layer of color that is quite vibrant and um, maybe, well, tells you about the energy that I have, it's the happiness, all of that, that you associate with certain kinds of colors when it comes to painting and uh, artwork in all of its forms, you know? So uh, that's, that's what I'm doing here. And the whole page took me about 40 minutes. So uh, this was a very quick one, because again, I currently can only work for like three hours a day and uh, not for my usual 12 to 14 hours when it comes to artwork so I gotta be quick and that limits me in a way that I don't like because I might want to draw or paint some more um, bigger paintings or have techniques that require um, my hands not hurting and uh, just the way you hold a brush or you hold a pen and stuff like that so yeah I'm, I'm kind of limited with the way I can work on my art journal page here but again I'm not uh, complaining I'm a bit uh, well annoyed by that because I can't do all the things that I want to do and that's fine I know it will pass so I'm just it's just the realization that my hands are the important most important tool and that uh, well I, I need them you know so I'm drawing in with a permanent marker I'm just drawing some outlines of my right hand and then of my left hand because I usually paint with my left hand but there's some things that I do with my right hand also especially currently that I have to balance and uh, have the workload be uh, on both hands to well be able to work longer hours so with some indigo um, acrylics and my brush I'm just filling in the gaps which um, means like the background I'm outlining the hands giving them a bit of a shadow here and there on the thumb in, in a few minutes and then I'm already having what is in my mind an interesting page. Um, there is just a lot of layers here. There is a lot of color. Still, it looks kind of simple or clean, but um, because I applied the colors in the background, like the yellow and the red, with a palette knife, there's texture 
texture and there's um, a bit more interest to it and just vibrancy, I think. So once that is dry, I think it also it, it kind of reminds me of graffiti a bit. Uh, that style, it's just yeah, it's simple, but I think it's it's almost urban artwork style. Yeah. So once it's dry, I'm going to use my stencil with. Um, the splotches here and a bit of gesso just to have a place where I could put well I don't want to say the sentiment but more like the title of the page um, I did want to go bold and uh, well again staying with the urban style so I didn't just write it down with a white permanent marker which would have been a possibility as well, but it would have looked way more structured and clean and um, not as fitting with the rest of the style of the page. So I'm drawing that and that I'm just using my permanent marker to write down a few words in, uh, in the fingers of the page, which just, it, it just reminds me of how valuable my hands are to me and in that white splotch I'm just writing down the title. So what I'm writing down here is my most important tool for doing artwork, the means to show what I see and then I'm sorry for the background but I got ha noise but I gotta have my my window open it's goddamn warm here. Then I'm writing down creativity in my head is shown to the world by them and uh, I'm lost if they don't work 100%. And the title I'm just writing down my hands and then I'm adding the date and that's that. So thank you very much for watching along. It's a very simple page, it's, uh, it's also quite a quick video again. but. I hope you liked it and maybe got some ideas, something uh, for some artwork that you would want to do. And uh, I will see you next week with a new art journal page and tomorrow with the Tiny Tuesday. Stay tuned, like, share, subscribe as always and thank you again for watching. Bye bye!